Dear students, in this video, let us learn about exponents. Say, suppose you have, why you need exponents? Suppose you have large numbers like this. See here, 8547100. So, it's way, you don't know how to read it or it's very difficult to read after number after close places. Uh, so, that case, you need something called exponents. So, in exponent form, this number can be written as 8.5471 into, see here, count, uh, leaving 8, count the number of digits, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So, it will be 8.47 into 10 raised to 14. Now, this is the exponent form of this number. To make express, expression of the larger numbers easier, you need exponents. Which is easier to read this one or this one? Definitely 8.5471 into 10 raised to 14 is easier to read. So, in a if you have a exponent term c a raised to b now here a is the called as base and b is called as exponent you can write you can take any base, see here, uh, suppose you have a number 81. Now, 81 can be expressed as 3 into 3, see, 3 into 3, 9, 9 into 3, 27, 27 into 3 is 81. So, you have the common term multiplied here is 3 and how many times you have multiplied the term 1, 2, 3, 4. So, 4. Here 3 raised to 4. This, this is said as 3 raised to 4. You read this as 3 raised to 4. Here 3 is the base and whatever you write on the top that is exponent. If you have uh, any number like uh, 36, you can write it as multiples of 2. C2 into 2, 4, 4 2 are 8, 8 2 are, sorry, not 36, 32 you can write it as multiples of 2. 2 2 are 4, 4 2 are 8, 8 2 are 16, 16 2 are 32. Now you have multiplied here 2, so 2 is the base. You have multiplied it 5 times, so 5 is the exponent. This number is 32 for 36. See, you can write as 6 into 6. You have multiplied here 6 twice, so base is 6, the power is 2, so it is 6, 2. Now some common terms. Like uh, if you have a any number raised to 2 then see here 6 square you have 6 raised to 2 so here 6 raised to 2 can be written as 6 squared. So, any number raised to 2, it can be written as that. So, if you have 4, four raised to 2, it is 4 squared or 5 raised to 2, it is 5 squared and so on. So, any number raised to 2, it, it is said as squared and uh, any number raised to 3 
so any number raised to 3 these are some of the common terms any number raised to 3 that will be that is said as cubed cube so it so 4 raised to 3 is 4 cubed 5 raised to 3 is 5 cubed 6 raised to 3 is 6 cubed and so on so raised to 2 is squared and raised to 3 is cubed suppose uh, when you have something like uh, when the base is 10 how you count the exponents see here if you have 1000 it is 10 and count the number of zeros 1 2 3 so 1000 is 10 raised to 3 suppose you have 1 lakh then it is 10 and count the number of zeros 1 2 3 4 5 10 raised to 5 suppose you have one more some larger term see here you write it as 10 raised to count the number of zeros 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so this is how you write the exponents when base is 10 the same principle you have used here see you are writing 10 raised to 14 because here you have taken point here and then counting the number of digits leaving the first number 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 so you have written 8 minus 5 8.5471 into 10 raised to 14 in the exponent form so these are the basics of exponents i will explain you uh, certain problems in my next video thank you